following that RV. Thousands of high school seniors who plan to attend college in the fall need to finalize their school choice today. May won the deadline, but many future college kids worry about the higher costs of higher education. Fox Force John Pepitone with how some are getting help from Uncle Sam. As chairman of a Senate subcommittee that funds education, Senator Roy Blunt helped increase Pell Grants to nearly $6,100. The Pell Grant really does help me a lot. Danielle Swinney is one of about 130,000 students at Missouri colleges that rely on government grants to help avoid large and costly student loans. <laughs> Senator Blunt pushed to reestablish year-round Pell Grants, allowing students to stay in school during the summer, complete their degree sooner, and graduate with less debt. Well, the quicker you get uh, your basic higher education behind you, the less debt you're going to have and the sooner you're going to get be getting a paycheck uh, that's a paycheck that's reflective of what you've learned in higher education. At University Academy, a group of lucky students received scholarships worth $10,000 a year for up to five years. The KC Scholars Program focuses on finding students who are the first in their family to complete college. We know she's going to be very relieved to not have to worry about the financial part of college and just enjoy learning, which she always has loved to do. Most of these scholarships go to families that can only afford to pay less than $4,000 a year for schooling. No one is just me and my mother feel like it would be a little difficult, but if I were to um, keep working, I could possibly get scholarships from other colleges. KC Scholars will award 919 scholarships this year alone. That's a 40% boost over last year. John Pepitone, Fox 4 News. Senator Blunt says the government funding bill that became law in March also increased federal work study money for college students. It went up 15%.